Diane, 11.30 a.m., February 28th. I have decided to take a few days off. I'm moving to a new place in California. One meal, breakfast, eggs, sausage, toast, jam, juice, and the usual coffee scented hot water. According to the traditional Christian calendar of saints from Roman Catholic and Eastern Orthodox countries, today is the feast day for people named Romaine, the first name of Lee Movie Geek. Happy feast day. February is the month with the least number of days in the year, and today is already the last day of the month. It's time for the tradition of the channel. Let's talk about Lee Movie Geek's Movies of the Month. Three O'Clock High by Phil Jonu is a sadly underrated teen movie of the 80s with highly stylized cinematography. It's a kind of remake of Fred Zinnemann's Western High Noon in a high school in which the nerdy main character manages to get himself into an after-school fight with the school psychopath because he did not respect the social distancing. Some people in the cast sounds familiar. I'm telling you, this guy's supposed to be a total psycho. Oh, I've got to stop being so petty. Also, I'm pretty sure the seduction scene between a young student and his English teacher is the kind of scene that would be impossible to make today. Unbelievable. We already know what happened after that. The next film is a Hammer film from the early 70s. Not Dracula, or Frankenstein, but Dr. Jekyll. Dr. Jekyll? And not Mr., but Sister Hyde. <laughs> this gothic thriller directed by Roy Ward Baker is a nice and interesting variation of the well-known short story by Stevenson. Ralph Bates is the doctor while Martin Beswick plays the evil female part of him. Both did a terrific job as they look remarkably like each other. Beswick started her career in two different James Bond films, From Russia With Love. <laughs> and Thunderball. Down in London I've made contact with a girl. Well, it's not what I'd call contact. There is also Susan Broderick that I only knew for her short part in Michelangelo Antonioni's Blow Up. Is that it? That's it. You can't treat it like that. It's not a delivery van. Who cares? China 9. Liberty 37 is a spaghetti western made by American director Monty Hellman. Starring the American actor Warren Oates, the Italian Fabio Testi, the magnificent British actress Jenny Agutter, and in a guest appearance, Sam Peckinpah, one of the greatest American filmmaker who revolutionized the way westerns were made. Also, it's impossible not to mention the cool musical score by Pino DiNaggio. Forgotten French film director and screenwriter Jacques Brel. Adieu les mille, je vais mourir. C'est dur de mourir au printemps, tu sais. Brel with an A, not Brel, has passed away last month. His most famous cult film, Exterior Night, describes the story of a trio relationship between one female taxi driver played by Christine Boisson and two men played by Andre Duzalier and Gerard Lanvang. J'ai une solution. T'épouse. On prend un appartement dans un HLM en banlieue. On fera une flopée de gosses. Tu conduis un bus, moi je donnerai des leçons de piano. 
dimanche, je vais jouer à la fanfare municipale. Tu trouves ça drôle, toi Pas vraiment, mais c'est une solution réaliste. It's a kind of chills and gem in a pale Paris by night with a dark urban atmosphere shot after sunset or in the wee hours of mornings. And now, the number one. It's another film directed by Jacques Brel. Adieu les mille. Polar, a very low budget adaptation of a French detective novel by Jean Patrick Manchette with a great cast, including a cameo of another great film director, Claude Chabrol, as a porn filmmaker. Vous savez que je suis un homme très occupé, Monsieur Tarpon. Vous avez un nom de poisson. John Francois Bolmer is excellent as Eugene Tarpon, an unsuccessful amateur detective who gets into big trouble. J'ai réfléchi encore un bon moment pour voir s'il y avait quelqu'un à qui annoncer mon départ. Je savais bien que non. J'aurais bien aimé avoir un téléviseur pour le mettre en marche et m'en repaître, comme tout un chacun, en attendant de perdre conscience. Je me suis contenté de regarder par la fenêtre pour contempler le vaste spectacle du monde. J'ai beau regarder, il n'y avait rien à voir. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Now please take care and stay safe. We will meet again soon.